Alan, tonight firefighters are still out here high above what's left of this waste management plant. They are dousing some still burning hot spots, trying to keep this fire from reigniting. Unruly spring winds spread sparks from a small urban prairie fire. The way the wind was blowing, it looked like it was some swirls in it. In a matter of minutes, it ignited a southwest side recycling plant that quickly erupted into a full-blown inferno. One side was fire, and then the other side was like, like catching on fire, like smoking. As fire trucks raced to the burning Brighton Park plant, employees scrambled out just ahead of the flames. I heard one guy ask if anyone was still in there. With everyone out safely, firefighters, about 150 of them, came at the fire from every angle dousing it from extended ladders. At one point, they say flames got dangerously close to propane tanks and vats of acid, prompting nearby L trains to stop service. My biggest concern was the spread, the spread of the fire, you know, due to the high wind conditions. Firefighters moved in a massive oversized fan to help clear smoke from rescuers' view. Wood pallets and cardboard made for easy burning tinder. All the uh, contents is buried. So once it starts burning, it's hard to get underneath it. So any kind of oxygen introduced keeps it burning. Hours and thousands of gallons of water later, firefighters subdued, then finally stopped the blaze, even saving a bit of the building. Tonight, firefighters are bringing new equipment and more engines back here to the scene with winds still blowing tonight. They want to make sure that fire doesn't re-spark. You can also see there are bulldozers starting to move some of the debris down at the other end, trying to damp down any hot spots. But tonight, the orange line is back up and running. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.